We're hoping to take you on a special journey tonight in terms of our food and our food journey and how it's woven with our music and culture. Because Kachita Nis Far and a Kyol Bio August Bia Blast out, what is better than live music and tasty food? feeling connected with the audience and maybe helping them understand some of the stories behind the songs. For many, many years I toured in the States and that was the only way I could make a living as a, an Irish musician. And now to see festivals like Imbolc and other festivals around the country is incredible. I hold no cold thoughts towards anyone, no fear to believe in. Black train round the bend to send me to weeping. The most rewarding part of everything for us, like when you write a song and it hits home, and we both we both like it. It's like it now beats that feeling, you know. Towards the healing. It's been easy to write together. Not necessarily everything we write is a hit, but we know we write an awful lot of songs, so we. For that last, the new record we wrote about 50 or 60 and just took 12. Music for us has always just been like a friend, a healer or a companion. And we, we were lucky to grow up around it too. When we safely reached the other side in three and twenty days, we were taken as passengers by the hand and we were led round in six different days. Close me eyes and I can picture, if I'm singing a particular song, I can sing, close me eyes and I can see the, the, the whole story just unfolding, you know, behind my eyelids, it's like as if I've got a, two film screens in behind there and, and I'm watching TV, <laughs> basically is the easiest way to explain it. I've played here a few times before uh, in, in Derry and um, actually I won, when I won the FLA, it was actually when the FLA was held in Derry, which was, was great in 2013, that's why I, I hold Derry as one of uh, the best flowers ever. <laughs> left on Paddy's green shamrock shield. 